if you have a complete flat fold, if something gets in it, it does the screen. Where's yeah. that? So you see the gap. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I've, I've dabbled. Yeah. 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 There's nothing wrong with running on a table with a monster on the bus, uh, but um, I just find it a bit. Watch though, we're missing out on the watch goodness. Oh, yeah, no, that's right. Really intuitive that I reckon I could legitimately pull it out, do things on that external screen, and put it away again. Whereas with this, The Flip is undoubtedly the story of this launch. It's a really beautiful product. Samsung is the market maker for foldables and they've taken it to the next level. But they've also had to do that because the competitive landscape has intensified as well. Um, but I personally think it's a lovely device and I think the full size screen on the front of the device adds a lot of extra value for consumers. This is how the real trade is. It's, it's like for, for, for the people on, who are on the grind. Like, I don't know what they're doing. Oh, hello. <laughs> That's hilarious. I, I'm not sure I like what, what a pain in the ass feature this is. You ready? Go on and turn the torch on quick. It makes a little pen noise when you work. I think the overall compactness of these devices, although it's slightly marginal, and the weight reductions as well, just make them more comfortable in the hand, just make it a more refined experience, and certainly it means that it raises the competitive benchmark. So Samsung is now facing a lot more competition in the foldables market, so it really did need to step up. It's clear that Samsung has found a form factor that it believes in and it's happy to take that incremental improvement stage because the reality is most consumers have never had a foldable device in their hands. So for most of them it will be a new experience whichever product they go for. The interesting thing is that foldable isn't for everybody and I think that unless Apple does it, it won't be legitimized completely, but you can see that Samsung see it as key to showing innovation, driving differentiation, and in the case of the Flip also, pushing harder into a female uh, demographic where they can see a real opportunity to try and seduce people away from iPhone or at least keep them away from iPhone with a new device with a new form factor with nice colors and a lovely user experience.